Welcome back to Discover Down Under, where Tin's checking in with our friends at the Royal Flying Doctor Base in Dubbo. It's not just taking sick people to hospital, getting a doctor to a station. There are so many more roles now that the flying doctors fulfil. Yeah, exactly right, Tim. Um, these days, we, we're involved a lot with allied health and primary health care. We run, uh, like, for instance, here out of Dubbo here, we run a, uh, a dental clinic. Yes. We run mental health programs. And... and that's so important because by the very nature of the tyranny of distance, they feel very alone and they're right, they are. Exactly. You know, people out on a, on a cattle station, they're they probably don't see people for weeks mm. on end and uh, you know and if, and if something goes wrong I mean we're their uh, first port of call we're their lifeline back to uh, to some, to a place of care a place of safety So how many staff are based here in Dubbo? I think we have about 25 staff here. And uh, then we've got uh, our visitor centre. That's actually staffed by volunteers from the Dubbo support group. So all the people you meet in the visitor centre are doing it all on their own time. And they're, they're a very dedicated group of people. They, they actually seeded the uh, funding to actually build this place. Remember Discover Down Under lovers, it's not only people living in the bush that benefit from the Royal Flying Doctor Service. For caravan and campers, you guys provide an amazing backup service for them. Oh, exactly, you know, people travelling all around the uh, around Australia, mm. um, travelling in you know out on, in the remote areas, you know, your grey nomads, people mm. driving around on their around Australia trip of a lifetime. You know, they can have care within two hours, no matter where they are yeah, in Australia. Are. Yeah because uh, the RFDS will come and uh, come and get them. Well, this is the pastoral. It should go all right. Thanks, Sarah. Thank you. Cheers. Yum. Look at that, Tim. Wow. Really good veggies. Straight up. Heaps of chips. Parma, not on the chips. Now, you do have the choice between mm. veggies or salad. Today, we've tried something a bit different. We've gone for veggies. Which is fantastic. Oh, yum. That cheese looks good. The sauce and bacon. Good. Look at that. Ready, set, go. go. <laughs> it really is nice. Mm. Oh, Brookie. Just smells so nice. This is a really good one. More, please. That was really good. Have a good look at that. I wish you guys were here to taste this because this is actually really special. Tim, this is an amazing pub parma. Mm. I'm blown away. I'm absolutely blown away. There's yeah. something about that bacon on top of the cheese. And it is one of the best pub parmas I've ever had. It's ticked all the boxes. We'll have to rate it. You ready? Set. Go. Go. I rated it 9.5 and then it gave it an extra oh. 0.3. That's got to be our leader. It is. I think it is. I'm sorry, Brookie, but I have to do the corn thing. <laughs> <laughs>